This isn't silence, so I can't really, uh... Do much here. Nothing in here. This guy alone? Guys over here yelling. My lucky day. The Brits must have been sitting down for tea and crumpets instead of shelling the Germans. Still, I had to get through to our side of the line before those guns started up again. Stop throwing that, please. Holy crap. Can I not go around? Oh, you know what? I have lures. Duh. Do that. All right, I got one of them away. Let's see if I can get that one away. Okay, that works. Those trenches were packed full of the Kaiser's finest, but hopefully, most of them would be looking for trouble coming the other way. Hopefully.
No sleep for you. That's always good. Silence, please. Uh, oh, what is this? Whoa. All right. Nope. I like my rifles. That works. And that works. Why do I keep pressing that? There's only two of them there. Can I leave them? Do I have to go? Ninja! I am the stealth master, yeah. I love that they added stealth, man. I love it. I can never get it quite right, but... I'm getting the hang of it. Nothing over here? God damn it. Oh! Oh my god. Didn't see that. I didn't see that. I didn't see that. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, 
bring it on. I'm ready for all of you. Machine guns at my back kind of encouraged me to keep my head down. No Man's Land was a maze of barbed wire, dead bodies, and debris. But I held my course. God, these bodies though. Did anything survive the crash that might be useful? George Rackham, are you? Son of the fourth bloody Earl of Windsor. <laughs> How naive do you think I am? Oh. Uh, let's get out of here. Oh, man. Losing a lot of blood. I didn't have much time to get back. Uh, this is your bloody fault. Uh, Germans. No man's land. You see them? The Germans aren't really known for the crowd. They did everything they could to catch us. It's not fair! Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Now. Just, just a few 
Wilson said I was a no good, lying son of a bitch. I brought him home because I think he's probably right. And I hate that fact more than I can tell you. This guy's a bloody hero. No, he's nothing of the sort. He's a cheat, a thief, and a liar. And he'll answer for his crimes. That's right, Blackburn. to the farm, are you? I'm gonna speak up for you, you know, at the court martial. It might do you some I doubt good. It, but thanks. Wilson, with me, I need a gunner. Over here, I'll, I'll do it. Racco, let me help. You don't deserve to fly. Wilson, if I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die up there. Come on, let's do this. You sure you don't want to sit this one out? Not a chance. You owe me a bloody medal. Okay. My God. God, friendly fire. That was some bloody good flying. Well, no, it wasn't. Hell of a story. Ah, oh, shit. Bombers incoming. The bombers are the threat. We have to take them down.
Oh my god. Barrel roll ain't gonna work. I play Star Fox. Uh -uh. Well, I gotta catch up. I gotta catch up.
Wow. I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die up there. You and your big mouth. God. All right, we gotta get up there. Don't look down. All right. All right. Just don't bloody look down. We gotta get the black gun. This is madness. That gun is knocking seven shades out of our lot. We have to grab it. I can't really see it. Just straight ahead. Whoa. Now you pull out your gun. Oh my god. Alright. Holy shit. Me and you. Shoot his face. Keep him busy. Shoot the salvation. my story a selfish man who risked his own life to save another and in doing so found he was saved himself things get mixed up in wartime though and you'll probably hear other versions a rogue pilot who stole a plane who killed his buddy 
then lied, cheated, and murdered his way across half the Western Front, only to escape court-martial in the chaos of an air raid. But don't listen to any of that. What you heard from me is the truth. I wouldn't tell you if it wasn't. Would I? But why you gotta end it like that, though? Now I don't know if they believe him or not. <laughs> uh.